Count yourself blessed. If you are still here and you have your family members still here, nobody passed away, thank you, Jesus. I'm not going to knock on wood, but I'm just going to give God his praise and honor that he deserves for keeping us. What's up, my love bugs and love muffins? It's Mama Love, and welcome back to my channel. I'm here tonight on a Sunday night. Happy Val Valentine's Day to you all. And uh, I just want to show you our meal preps for tomorrow so that when I go into the workout video, y'all already have the meal prep was planned, what we're having. Um, I just came home from service, you all, and the meal preps are here. So I'm just going to go by. Look like they already towed this tray up, though. These kids, I'm going to ask, and Tina Terrell don't went to the store. And I'm, I'm going to ask, where is the strawberries and pineapples that came in here i don't know if this is just for a snack or is this to add inside of a smoothie but it really doesn't matter because i do have uh fruit already for smoothies so i'm i'm guessing that breakfast is going to be smoothies which is fine with me or banana or granola bar whatever i grab out in the morning before i go work out but anyway these are the meal preps for the week kind of tight y'all i ain't gonna lie i'm always happy with the meal preps or whatever this week it looks like she, she it looks like she grinding us for real because i'm i'm, I'm starting to y'all y'all do the math y'all do the math on the calories on this but anyway it's supposed to be a packet of these they come in different flavors you all this is for lunch and a boiled egg okay a packet of tuna and a boiled egg that's for lunch this is for dinner. Now this is ground turkey with some stir fry. Uh, we got, look like bell peppers, little thing of broccoli in here, and maybe some onions inside this turkey bowl. Tur ground turkey, ground stir fry turkey with the lettuce and the wraps are made up, okay? So this is it. This is it for the meal prep. Calculating a smoothie and a pack of tuna and a boiled egg and a ground stir fry turkey wrap. I don't think that is even near a thousand calories, you all, for this week. So. She really, really limited it. May I say limited this week is like limited for real, for real. Because in this pack right here, okay, per pack. All right, here we go, per pouch, 110 calories. It's only how many calories in a boiled egg? I don't even think it's, I wanna guess maybe about 25 to 45 calories. Um, I wanna do the math on this. Um, these wraps are not even, oh, probably over 100 in calories. Lettuce, of course, is nothing. And this vegetables is nothing. Ve I know broccoli itself is 25. Uh, calories so when we got ground turkey in there we really not that's not really much either so this is probably not even near 700 calories for this week 700 not for this week but a day this is not near 700 calories even and, and I heard that we're supposed to be over 1200 to 1500 calories to lose a pound but I heard that if you were under that that it doesn't lose as fast. So we're going to see this week. But I ain't, I'm not knocking nothing my trainer doing. I trust her process. I trust her. I trust the process. We may not always like things how um, it may be handed. Because basically she said, y'all eating what I want y'all to eat. And so I lost 16 pounds in four weeks. So I'm not knocking her. Okay. But <laughs> and, 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 and anything that is prepared for us as far as meal prep, I will say it is awesome. The food is good. But she got me with these tunas. She probably going to watch this video. <laughs> this tuna packet and these eggs, you got me, sis. You got me on that one. But I can't do nothing but respect and trust the process. I may not like it, but I'm going to respect it. And I'm going to go by it. So this is what we got for this week as far as meal preps, you all. Um, 
God give me strength. I had been having a problem. I text my um, trainer Saturday, because I'm upfront and honest with y'all, transparent as I could be. I text my, um, well, I wanted to text my trainer and say, can I um, have a bag of Doritos, y'all? Because Saturday I was rocking back and forth like a fiend, okay, tripping. And I don't know why, but some things we put in our spirit, best believe it, we got to be careful what, you, what we what we watch out these eye gates and what we hear out our ear gates. And I wasn't craving no Doritos until I was watching Faith Squad chew on them doggone uh, tacos. Because I was watching her, um, I was watching her mukbang. And I feel like if I can't eat it, well, I'm going to watch somebody else eat it, you know? And what happened was it just got in my spirit. And all of a sudden, I just had the urge to munch on these, crunch on these Doritos the way she was crunching on them taco shells and them, you know, so I need to be careful. But anyway, I, to be honest, I called her, my, my, well, my son texted her. I thought it was too late, but he texted her. No, actually, I wanted to text her. And my son FaceTimed her and was like, mama wants some Doritos. <laughs> so she saw me on FaceTime and she was like, no, don't do it. All that hard work, you know. And that's all I wanted was that encouragement because sometimes I fall back, y'all. I'm human, but... I didn't touch them Doritos, you know, it, she got me by. And then she was like, I should just make you get on the treadmill for just even wanting to, you know, but I'm thankful for her. I really am. And um, so I, I'm, I'm sticking to this. It, yeah, it's tight, you know, and they say in church it's tight, but it's right. <laughs> it may be tight, but it's right, y'all. I'm looking at this like when she called this out, we, we, we on the um, phone with her. Or texting her. I'm driving and Tina texting her. We was like, what's this menu? What? Yeah, a package of uh, tuna and a boiled egg for lunch. Man, we hollered down the freeway, okay? We hollering down the freeway. Like, you got to be serious. Like, really? But I got a birthday coming up. Because, y'all, I'm taking this in three-month segments. So, um, my birthday is in April. And when y'all hear us say, when you got to April, that does not mean the diet is over. That means that's my goal. I'm trying to reach for my birthday, and then I'm after my birthday, April, we got April, May, June, July, then I'm taking it to July, y'all, this is the summertime, all right, so that's my summer, and then I'm going, after that, we got July, August, September, October, then I'm taking it to October, that's another goal, so I'm taking this in three months segments, so I'm not even at uh, my first segment yet until it hits April, and that's how I do it, but I'm going to respect the process, though. <laughs> I keep holding these two up. I mean, these wraps, this kind of, it look good, y'all. I should be filling for dinner and stuff like that. And we get our gallon of water in. But, y'all, I'm telling y'all. What happened to this fruit, Tina? Because this Terrell, is a half. Yeah. Terrell this was picking in it. Wow. This, yeah, so this is. He was picking in it. It wasn't me. Yeah, so what's this supposed to be for breakfast or what? I, I believe so. Oh, wow. Uh, okay. Well, I'm, I'm glad I got uh, I got packages of y'all. Packages of frozen fruit. Um, So I'm not going to trip on that. But I got pineapple, mango, strawberries. Um, I got kiwi. I got grapes. Frozen, you know, to make um smoothies with. So I'm not going to trip. But, yeah. So this is it, y'all. On the meal preps. And, yeah, she tight with it. It's tight, but it's right, y'all. I got to get this off me. Plus, you know, um, your mind play tricks on you. I don't know if y'all know, but when you lose weight, other people see it before you do. And my mind was playing tricks on me the other day. And I'm like, I ain't lost nothing. Who am I fooling? You know, I'm still feeling all bad and stuff. But, you know, our, our eyes and our mind is still fat. <laughs> you know, so I'm not, I'm not seeing it. But I'm also telling myself, Reva, this is going to be the sixth week when we go to the gym tomorrow. So our sixth week. And... But you can't expect you to be skinny, baby, in those six weeks. Or even even half at your goal. So ain't no need for you to sit up here and trip and stop looking at yourself in the mirror. When y'all walk past the mirror every morning, don't don't glare at it. Like, you know, this ain't, what is this? I ain't lost no, you, you, it's not going to fall off overnight. But I got to tell myself, we did not put it on overnight. It's not going to fall off overnight. You know, so we got to take our time in this and trust the process. But first of all, I trust God. I trust God. I had to call on him, y'all. I did because I was having a hard time. I was feeling discouraged. And this post I saw on Facebook, it came back to me. And I know it was the Lord. It came back to me and was like, it said something like, you may not like the way you're looking as far as weight loss goes, but 
you're not gonna get no better, basically, if you give up. You're not gonna really like how you look, but if you stick to it, you're gonna wish you, it's, it's like if you don't stick to it, you're gonna wish you were where you, I can't, I gotta, I gotta get the phone, but it's, it's a post I had, I had shared it. But in other words, you're not gonna, um, if you give up, you're never gonna get there, basically. And, but if you keep going, you're gonna see results that, it may not be the results that you wanna see, but you'll see results. And if you was still the same size, you would look on the results that I lost now and be like, dang, I wish I was there, instead of being bigger. If y'all get what I'm saying, because I can't remember the post, but. Anyways, y'all, I just wanted to share this with y'all. And I'm, I'm, like I said, it's, I don't think this is over. 700 calories. Y'all put in the comments, y'all. Put in the comments below um, what y'all think. Um, like I said, I trust the process, but I don't think this is over seven or even to a thousand calories for this week. But hey, we gotta push it. We gotta push it, you know? Cause I got that birthday in April. This is a short month in February and I figure I got all of March. Hey, I'm gonna do what she say do. Plus we got a beat feet in that gym. And I don't like to, I have not cheated because I don't like to feel bogged down in the gym with foods that I have cheated with. You know, y'all know foods make y'all heavy. They make y'all tired and weak. And I ain't got time to be in no gym being all tired and weak and then Reba looking at me with that eyebrow like, what's wrong with you? Like, why are you feeling that way? Cause you shouldn't be. You know what I'm saying? Yo, portions is cut down and they're healthy. Like, why you breathing hard? What you eating? So I ain't got time for that. Cause uh, I think she will make you do some 100 sit-ups or something. You get caught cheating or something burpees. like that. Yeah, burpees and I ain't got to do that. But she gonna make me do something. So I ain't got time to be cheating. So Reba, you ain't got to worry about that, baby, if you're watching this. I'm not cheating. But I appreciate you and I appreciate the meals. But it's tight, Reba. It's tight. But it's right. All going in. And that's what I gotta tell myself. It's tight, but it's right. Oh, what I'm eating tomorrow. I'm gonna be saying it's tight, but it's right. I mean, you can't make a mayonnaise, twist it up with a mustard up in it. You just can't. You just open it up and eat it out the bag. My God. No. I feel like, I feel like we back in them Euclid days where it was like, all oh, y'all open up a can because we ain't got nothing to them steps. Come on. <laughs> Uh, no, she like, said you eating this right out the pouch, boo, and you're not adding no mayonnaise to this. I'm talking about garlic salt. Well, I'm saying a little seasoning's already come as hickory smoke, and you could add, I guess, a little seasoning, but I ain't. No, I it's mean. different flavors in there, I think. Okay, well then, we don't need to add none, because there's flavors to it already. So, hey, y'all, I just wanted to tell y'all that, show y'all this, and... It's tight, but it's right. Peace out in Jesus' name. Be blessed. <laughs>